And really, over the last almost year, we have sent over bill after bill that cuts regulations so that government gets off the backs of small businesses. We've sent over bills that cut spending so that people will know they won't have to continue to pay even more in taxes to pay off the federal debt. But each one of those bills, each one of those bills of relief for families and small business has ended up in what I call the cul-de-sac of the United States Senate. And that Senate, working along with the White House, has provided a real block to the kind of vision that we have for America. So I'll tell you one thing, we need reinforcements. That's why all of us need to set our sights on next November and to make sure that we elect George Allen to be our Virginia Senator. And you can see it. You can see it now. The other side has its sight squarely focused on our former governor and senator, George Allen. And I'm asking you now to pledge to do everything we can, because if George wins, we can retake the Senate, and we can ensure the bills that we're putting over there to help families keep taxes low, to help businesses keep regulations low and sensible so we can get this economy going and get Americans back to work. That's what George Allen's election is going to be about. And if that wasn't enough for Virginia and her families, we'll once again have Susan Allen that we can claim as a wife of our United States Senator.